All right, guys, welcome back to the channel. Today is another exciting yet rainy day. Here we're at a Copart in Gastonia, and we're gonna check out some cars that we're gonna play. Um, you know, we gotta get more projects for the car, for the shop, right, Michael? Yep. So we got a little small list today, so it should be pretty quick because it's raining. So we want to be in and out pretty quick out of here. But this yard is full of cars, like full of cars, you know. So there should be a lot of inventory, even though I got like five on my list. But uh, it should be pretty quick. So let's go check out these trucks, these cars, or just trucks. I think it's just trucks and SUVs I'm looking at today. Nice. So let's check them out. Make sure there's no, uh, you know, hidden damage. We can find some easy repairs and uh, bid on them. Hopefully win something today. We got the trailer. We can put it on the trailer because most of my stuff, Michael, needs a trailer. I don't Dang. think we can drive anything home. Maybe. You never know. But uh, we are like an hour out. So let's go ahead and check everything out and go from there. All right, so here's the first one I got on my list. It's a Nissan Titan. So it looks pretty cool. It's like this weird brown gray color. I don't know. But this side, driver's side is looking really good. It is a 20, 2020. So, and it is a Pro X4. It means it's four by four. So this side is looking really good. Let's go to the, you know, the tape side. It's a good thing it's all taped up, but check that out so definitely needs a bumper that module is good though so bed no big deal back glass is broken the pillar the door the door the other fender the top looks good the running board's even good oh this bumper so maybe it laid on its side or hit something or scratched it all the way but, I don't know, not too bad. It's inside and no power, but this is pretty nice. Surprisingly, the glass didn't break all the way. But, um, pretty good looking. Let's see, maybe we should get the jump box. Maybe not. Let's check out the hood over there. Oh, that's, I mean, other than the damage, it looks pretty good. This wheel is churned a little bit. And this wheel's churned, so that's a good sign. Probably no suspension damage. So everything else looks here pretty good. All that looks good. It's pretty good. Oh yeah, let's double check the airbags. Make sure all the airbags are good. Oh, uh, so the seatbelt did deploy. Oh, yeah, these deployed both sides, but I don't know. I guess we're just going to have to see what this thing goes for. But besides the damage, I like it. Let's keep going. And here is the next one. For some reason, it's another Nissan, but we got like the little brother. You know, we got the big brother we checked out. Now he's got the little... I mean, it's not little, but this is the new style Frontier. They're pretty cool. This is a 22. Also, it's got door damage. So, driver's door definitely needs to be replaced. Uh, airbags deployed. You can see that's out. Got some camera. That's pretty cool. Will it open? Nope. This door is damaged too. Oh, look at that. It won't. But it's got like a matching top. So all this is looking pretty good. Let's keep going on this side. This side's all looking good. Suspension looks good. Let's check out the back seat. Pretty cool. Pretty clean looking. And this is 4x4? Not sure. But the interior has like these red or orange accents. Oh, it's a Pro X4 too. Wow. Let's see if it's got power. No power, but not bad. Kind of loaded, kind of sweet. Seatbelt deployed, one side roof airbag, the seat airbag deployed, so not that big of a deal. It's all closed, but 
maybe we could drive this thing home. I mean, it does have a door and a mirror and all the suspension's good. But let's check out the bottom. So the running board, oh, it, it uh, actually, yeah, you can kind of see it where it caved in right here. So this whole running board or dog leg needs to be pulled out. But the frame looks good. So I guess depending on the price, we'll see. I kind of would rather get the, the tie-in over this thing, but you never know. I mean, they're both a little bit nicerly loaded, but on to the next one. I guess we're having three Nissans today. So this is the next one. It's an older Nissan Frontier, but this is four x four extended cab and uh, has suspension damage as you guys can see. So we'll check out that really quick, see if the frame is bad or not. Let's go on this side. It looks pretty good. Everything looks, looks clean. It's raining, so we can't see if the paint is nice, but other than that, pretty good inside looking oh the airbags did deploy so the current airbag on that side deployed the seat belt's good on this side this is definitely something we can't drive here is the suspension so it looks like it came out of the ball joints out of the control arms so that's good and bad hopefully that went before bending the frame but this side, everything else is looking really good. I mean, oh, it's got power. So this side's looking pretty good. The door does have a little bit of damage. And then the fender has a lot of damage. So let's look at the suspension. So the frame did take a hit. So the bottom, it ripped out, the top ripped out. Wait, right here, you can see there's a little wrinkle so the frame did take a hit so that's not good sometimes it's uh you know not too bad let's pop the hood and double check some other stuff It is a V6 4x4, so this apron looks pretty good. Okay, so let's look at the frame rail. So this frame rail, you can kind of see it. Looks like that, and then this one. Well, you can kind of see where, right there. It bows in, the other side does not do that. So, I mean, you can put the suspension on, but you'll never pass alignment and everything else is definitely fixable, not a big deal. But maybe depending on the price, we'll see what it goes for. But we got one more to check out and it's auction time. So our last one we're checking out is going to be this Toyota 4Runner. So no more Nissans and apparently no Hondas or trucks, Toyotas. Well, one Toyota. But um, let's check out this one because this one definitely, um, I think in the picture, this wheel is sitting upside down or, or whatnot. But let's check this thing out. We'll do this last. Let's go around. The hood looks good. We got one good headlight. 
half a bumper, some grill thingy. These are pretty cool wheels. And then this side is looking really good. So somebody went mudding, a lot of mud in this thing, but it is pretty cool. It's a TRD off-road. Who knows if it's actually four by four or not. This side is looking pretty good besides, you know, the damage that we looked at. But let's go around and check out the back. So no leather, but does it have third row? Apparently it's kind of rare. And look at that, no third row, but we get a free shoe. So, oh, this thing is four wheel drive, I think, with a carbon fiber package, or wannabe, but that's pretty cool. It's got neutral, um, airbags did deploy. It's got some other cool stuff and no keys or there was keys and somebody broke it so that's unfortunate so maybe that's why there's no miles let's see maybe pop the hood this door should open yep and all the train sticker says 106 so that's not bad besides having no keys but let's pop the hood check this thing out a little bit more because these you can get a better deal on with suspension damage there's <laughs> only a reason why we're looking at it somebody messed with that okay let's check out the frame so the lower tabs are bent out of their minds. Look at that. So I don't know if I would say that's frame damage, but those tabs can be bent, no problem. This frame rail looks good. Then we got the A pillar or B pillar, C pillar. That looks pretty good actually. So I'd say the suspension is not too bad. It is four wheel drive. These knee assemblies are really expensive, but still doable so i guess we'll see what this is going to go for because the auction is starting pretty soon maybe i'll look at auction again and see if i like anything else with the low pre-bids but let's play some cars all right guys so this this thing's playing right next behind me man i can't even get in there Ten thousand already i'm losing 10 5 10 6 wow yeah. i mean it is pretty cool but the, the bottom one out 11 11 1 11 3 i'm losing but the frames sure are, the it. frames okay right i yeah, mean the frames good you can drive it home which i need to drive something home, right yep 11 5 missouri man i think i'm gonna play the other one instead because i thought you know this one's gonna go more than the other one but i think the other one's a better deal this, is but this nice. one's got a camper top it like does it. it looks all painted matching color yeah Little red hooks in the front, mat matching the Nissan emblem. Pretty cool. Little LED oh, lights. Cool. 12.3 already, North Carolina. What do you think? It's got like the Silverado front end little. And bonus time. How much? 12.7, 12.6 right now. 12.6. It's not 10, bad. Three. I know, it's like the first one though. Do you, do you buy the first one? Yeah. If it goes cheap. If it goes cheap. But it started off at 8,500. I mean, that's mm. kind of crazy that it goes that quick. And it's number two. Usually, like the first cars play kind of slow and kind of fast and, and cheap. 13 already. Wow. They want it. All I right. guess I uh, underestimated the value of this thing. Sold 13. Sold 13. There it goes, guys. Can't win them all, but it's just starting. The Nissan Titan's playing. I'm winning at 7,000. Cheaper than the Frontier. I don't know why. Wow. I'm winning. I'm Mexico again. You're Mexico again. That's my phone right there. Yeah, I don't know why it's registering as Mexico today. Maybe just for us, it's Mexico. I'm winning at 79. So far, it's actually pretty, I mean, it's going a lot less than the other one. I'm winning, I'm losing. 8,100, I think it's a It's really not bad, yeah. Bad. 83. 85, I'm winning, I'm losing. Oh. I mean, still, the other one went for what, 14,000? Yeah, yeah, 13, nine or and something. And this one, I think is a better deal. What year is it? This is a 2020, also a FX Pro X4. 
Mexico, I'm winning, I'm winning, and I'm losing. Oh. Maybe everybody else is having a glitch today, you know? Maybe it's South Carolina versus South Carolina right now. Or North Carolina. Bulgaria. Who needs a, who needs a truck in Bulgaria? I guess the Bulgarians. <laughs> 97. That's still that bad. I, Honestly, that's still really decent. 10, oh, 99. I'm winning. I'm losing. Dang. It's just me and Bulgaria. Mexico versus Bulgaria. <laughs> so. 10 3. Come on. Somebody, let's go. 10, oh, my goodness. 10 5. 10 so. 5. Let's go. I think that's a good number. 10 5. Let's go. Is it slowing down, though? Or is it? Yeah, it's slow there. Just me and that guy. 10 7. I think my last bid's gonna be 10 8. Which is his bid, so I'm out. Dang. 10 9, Mike. 10 9. Probably 11 2, Can we honestly. Go more? At this point. Is it in the budget? 11,000 Bulgaria. I'm not last, that excited. Last one, I last one. Hit it. Fine. 11 1 for Mexico. Not for me, Mexico. Yep. And I'm winning. And I'm winning. And I won it, Michael. Nice. Bonus time. Bonus, bonus time. Yeah, I was about to say. About to say. 11 1, bonus time. Nice. Really going to think about it. Come on, Bulgaria. Not bad. Not bad. And three more clicks. Oh. It's 11 3 already. Yeah, whatever. Think they can have it. Yeah, they can have it. It's good. We'll beat it up a little bit. It was fun. It was a little yeah, exciting. Excited, yeah. Know? Almost had it. It's like fishing. A couple nibbles. No catch. I still got two laps, so. We'll see. So the Nissan Frontier is playing. It's a 2900 already. I kind of don't want it. It's got frame damage. Oh man. You know? So nothing. No luck today, Ivan, huh? Not, not. I mean, we still got a one car for this. But yeah, the Nissan Frontier I thought would go less. Went crazy. The Nissan Titan. I mean, it is up there. You know. Yeah. For how much work it needed. Yeah. And then this Frontier, it is four wheel drive. But frame damage. miles. Yeah, frame damage but though. Airbags deployed. Or the seatbelt deployed. And it's got the frame damage, so. 3100, it's not bad. I just. Yeah, I don't know. Yeah. I can have it, I guess. So maybe I should click once. I don't know. So we've done that before. If you're not too excited about it, click it once, and all of a sudden it's yours. So. It's bonus time on them. Good thing I didn't click. Woohoo! Oh, told you. But it's Mexico, so is, is it you playing it? or? No, no, not this time. Okay. One time glitch. It was raining. And 32 sold. Yeah, that's fine. All right, guys, just like that, we are done. We are out of this yard. We are ready to hit the road. I did not buy anything, which is kind of sad, you know? I only had like four on my list. Maybe I should have looked at more cars. Uh, but, you know, Michael got two. You know, you guys will catch that in another episode. But uh, we have no room for it anyway, so we might as well hit the road. And, uh, until next time. Yeah, you know? I can't win them all, Ivan. Mean, it's can't okay. Win them all. You know, I wanted gotta... some trucks. Michael got some cars. So maybe next time I should just get some cars. Uh, but leave us a comment down below. Should we look for, you know, more trucks besides Nissans yeah. and Toyotas? But there was like, there's no other Silverados today that I liked. And a lot of them needed work. A lot of, a lot of work that I don't really want to do. And they're not that cool, you know? So, but we'll catch you guys next time. Leave us a comment.